Hello out there to all our Purple Eagle fans. My name is Chris Casey, the head basketball coach here at Niagara University. I hope everyone had an outstanding summer, but summer is over now, and more importantly, I hope everybody's ready for college basketball season. With our practices beginning the end of this month of September, we want to announce our captains for this coming year. Three captains that we are very, very excited about, three captains who have showed terrific leadership since the end of last season, and we're proud to have them as captains of our team. Matt Scott will be returning this year as a senior captain. Matt does so much for us on the basketball court. He's a two-time All-League performer in the MAC Conference. He was also top 10 in three separate categories this past season. He was top 10 in scoring, top 10 in rebounding, and top 10 in steals. Junior Marvin Prochet will return this year as one of our captains. Marvin's versatility on the court is invaluable to us. He can guard the other team's best perimeter player or the other team's best inside player. And Marvin can also score the ball from inside and on the perimeter. He was among the league leaders last year in block shots and rebounding and was third in our team in scoring. Senior Khalil Dukes was among the scoring leaders in the MAC Conference last year at number 11. His outstanding free throw shooting earned him the Niagara University free throw percentage record for a season previously held by Calvin Murphy, and it also earned him the number five spot in the nation in free throw shooting percentage. It, his point guard play was outstanding in conference. He was in the top 10 in assists per game, and he was also in the top 10 in assist to turnover ratio. We look forward to the leadership of these three young men on and off the court to help form our team. Fans, we need your support. Come out to the Gallagher Center, you'll see an exciting style of basketball, you'll see exciting players, and you'll see us win. Let's go Purple Eagles.